For those of you interested in investing, check out Webull, an amazing platform for buying and selling stocks, and now cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin, Dogecoin, and others. Open an account and get a free stock valued at up to $200, and fund your account and get another free stock valued at up to $1,600. Check out the link in the description and help the channel at the same time. Hey y'all, it's Dr. Know It All. MNX has sent me a couple of new cool products to look at and review, so quick unboxing. One of these days, somebody's gonna buy me a better knife than a kitchen knife. <laughs> but this will work, it works. <laughs> anyway, so this is a, um, this is a back cover for your Model Y. A lot of people complain about this because, of course, Model Y, even though it is an SUV, does not come with a back cover to hide your stuff when you're, you know, using your car. So anyway, that next comes for you. Whoopsie. <laughs> There we go. Has very thoughtfully provided this product for us. And I'll just open this up. Yeah, very nice. Got good, good. This is uh, a, yeah. Wow, this is actually really nice. This has got, I don't know, it just has that kind of heavy, heavy duty feel. It's not a cloth. I think it's actually some sort of cloth. Hush. It's not a cloth. It's some sort of like rubberized mesh. So you can see it's gonna be completely opaque. And I will have to test it out to see. Kona, I'll have to test it out to see how the fitment goes. They promise the fitment is excellent. This is generation Kona. She doesn't like it. Or maybe she does like it. Maybe she likes it a lot. Like this? <laughs> anyway, this is generation three according to the little sign on here. So um, uh, clearly what you do is you mount this here and then the little tabs go in there. With the How do you mount that? There's little stickies on there. So anyway, I will look, I don't think it's gonna be too challenging to figure out how to do this. Um, let's see, yes, there are instructions. Oh, there's other mount, there's other mount and stuff in here too. So yes, so there's this, and there's this, and instructions. Or a thank you. Oh, okay. Oh, I always like that they give me a screen cleaner. I keep those in my car because my screen inevitably, if you're touching it, gets dirty. Ah, here we go. So, yeah. So, it comes with ye old instructions on how to do this. So, basically, it looks like you peel the tape off, you stick it in place, and then you hook it into place when you need it. So, anyway, we'll go outside and look at that later. In the meantime, over here, Oh, <laughs> here is the tray and a shade for you. Yep, so there we go. That's Tosca. She's super awesome. If you uh, order anything from them, you'll probably likely interact with her. This is a kind of like a, I guess, eating tray or I guess a multi purpose tray that you can oh, put. I've been oh, I, know. I thought you'd be happy about ah. this. One. I know. So if you're like, you know, if you do like a lot of us do and you end up eating in the car and stuff, but you can see. It's got little, so where does that sit? I think it's between sits, the seats. I think it sits like this with the with between the, cup the holders, seats. and then it goes. I guess yeah, probably backwards. All right. There are just so many times with the laptop that we need something to put. Hey, so, here you go. I'm not sure what. So that's not the one that's at the steering wheel. That's the one that's at the. It'd be the one console. Yeah, the console in between. I'm not sure what this is. Don't know. I'll have to look. <laughs> Not exactly sure what this part does, but it's got little stoppers on it, so, oh. That looks like the thing you know that fits. What? It might be, oh, well that's really interesting. So I guess this, yeah, you really could put something there and so this would keep it from moving around, so that's super cool. So anyway, I can't wait to like, put this in. The installation should take about two seconds, and then, uh, you know, just take a look at how it, how it works. This should be really functional. Um, Is that cup yeah. holders? Yeah, so you push them down. Oh. Yeah. I like it. So I think that they go in the regular cup holders like this. And then the whole thing sits there. Yeah. Mm. So anyway, we'll give it a try out. But this is really cool. I think this is a brand new item. I think this is brand, brand spanking new. So anyway, super. I'm really happy to get to test out some of their new stuff. That's really cool. I also think that the Generation 3 uh, uh, back cover is also brand new. So they've had a couple of the generations. But they said this one's got even better fitment. So it fits right into your car. So. Anyway, can't wait to try these out and review them.
All right, so forgive the messed up garage. Still working on moving into the house. So I wanted to talk about the installation process for the back cargo cover. It's actually super, super simple. I have not put the adhesive down yet, but anyway, it's got adhesive on the back. They suggest taking some sort of a plastic knife or something to start it, so I'll do that in a minute. But basically what you do is for the back two pieces, and there's one over here, if you notice, there's one here, one here. Also, this is super cool. You can hang bags and stuff off of these little hooks underneath it, so that's really neat. But basically you just pull up the, uh, the little whatever <laughs> rubber gaskety thing and kind of push it up until the little V here goes into this slot, right? And then for the front ones, just stay there. I'll just come around. For the, for the front ones here, you pull them. So you go under the seat belt, push it through, and then it just, it just like basically just pops into place. The only thing they say is just make sure obviously that the seat belt still moves properly. But anyway, so now we just have to take the adhesive off and it works the same on both sides. Anyway, take the adhesive off and make it happen. So <laughs> I'll probably fast forward through this whole section. <laughs> All right, finally, <laughs> that's the hardest part of the whole installation process is getting these things started. Um, so anyway, once you've got the adhesive exposed, just go in and of course gently set it until it's in about the right spot. There we go. And then give it a press. So it kind of cuts right across where this thing is. I guess if you had to say, take a guess, it'd be right at the bottom of these little hanger thingies. Anyway, press the adhesive on and move on to the next one. All right, so the pieces are off. So again, put this under the seat belt, slide the seat belt over it, and then it, like I said, it just kind of, it just falls into position. It's actually really, this one's super easy. It's just it's a natural position. And again, make sure, again, this is super cool that you can hang stuff off of there. All right, I'm not gonna bore you with doing the other side, but the other side's exactly the same as this. So I will come back and I'll show you how the cover fits in here. All right, so this is the cover. Very, very nice, high quality. Um, and basically you've just got spring-loaded bars right here, right? So these things push in. So essentially, you should just be able to bring it in here, push the spring in, and voila, and voila. And then it just pulls out, I mean, Super duper simple, basically acts like any other cargo cover. <laughs> kind of amazing that, that Tesla hasn't decided that they needed to do this themselves. But anyway, so this is great. And then also, as I noted, if you have bags or anything like that, you can just hang them right in these little hooks. So I don't know, if you go grocery shopping or something, you can hang bags or things like that. So yeah, super, super cool. Very easy, obviously, you know, you can leave it up like this if you want to. If you need to take it out, it's as simple as pulling. Of course, you have to get in, but as pulling this guy in and out it comes. So it's there. It's not there. Sorry about the mail truck. <laughs> That's what happens when you have to film it outside. But anyway, so it's very, very straightforward. You can see this seat is leaned back. This one's leaned forward. So you can see there's plenty of clearance for either direction, whether it's uh, leaning forward or backwards in the back seat. So super cool and then i have one other thing to show you which is really neat i never would have thought about this but it's like a little table for your tesla all righty so first of all i wanted to say a quick thing about the uh, floor mats they're ev annex floor mats and i haven't washed this car in quite a while so i just took these things out and shook them out and they're super clean looking so they're really nice floor mats but anyway this is the cool thing they sent me this along with the rear cargo cover it is a little instantly makeable table for when you're on the road. So anyway, you can see how basically it just sets down right here and you're like, okay, so I can use my laptop on this. This is awesome. But also it's got, of course, cup holders. So you can also have dinner while you're waiting for your car to charge. So, you know, you and your, your friend or your partner can each have your, uh, I don't know what McDonald's, Burger King, Subway, whatever it is, Panera Bread, uh, whatever kind of meal you need to have. You can have that. You can put your drinks in here. You can be watching your movie. And, and this is like a really, really good thing. And then super, super cool. When you're done, you just fold it up, pop this thing off, 
and just slide it right underneath the car seat and it's gone. So it's completely gone until you need it and then you just pop it out, put the two pieces together as easy as pie and set it down. And there you have a really, really nice thing. So this is an actually really cool. You can tell it's actually a little bit used. We've used it a few times already. So, you know, when you, you can just, when you're out driving, you can just use it like whenever you need to, but it's so cool because it just slides right underneath the seat and then you don't have to think about it until you need it. And then you're like, wait, I could use a table and poof, there's a table. So really cool. Um, I haven't tried this while actually driving, but I think it should be fine while driving. I don't know. I don't want to guarantee that, but it's definitely something that you can use while you're stopped. But it should be fine while you're driving also, so you could leave things here. Um, it would be, yeah, I think it would be fine. So anyway, I don't know. <laughs> don't take my word for it. Take EV Annex's uh, word for it. But anyway, this is super, super cool. The rear cargo cover is something that Tesla obviously should have done themselves, but since they didn't, EV Annex has taken care of that problem for you. And I think these are great products. I'm always so happy when they, when they send me something. Again, just to be clear, they send me these products for review. I do not have to return them. They don't pay me. I get nothing. But there is definitely a link in the description if you want to take a look at these products yourself and purchase them for your Model Y or this would work with any Tesla. Obviously, there's no particular model that you need this one for. So anyway, until next time, I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.